Good afternoon, folks. How are you? It's been a while since I've done a video, much less a food review. Um, we'll be doing a, quite a few from home for a while, mainly because I'm trying to save money, because my girlfriend is going to come visit soon, and I need money to spend for while we're here, and I can't be spending it on fast food and stuff right now to do reviews. But I've still got stuff to do. I know it's been a little while since I've been making videos. Uh, I've been busy, got a lot of stuff going on in real life. Uh, cons and concerts, and I was in a play and stuff. I've just been very busy, and then I got sick. I'm still getting over that. But I haven't given you guys a Friday food review in a while, so I figure, hey, let's do a little something. It's a two-parter, uh, but we'll do it in one video. Uh, we're going to start off with these here. Oh, nice and reflective. Godiva Chocolatier. I love Godiva. Milk Salted Toffee Caramels, or Caramels, if you want to be fancy. Let's see, milk chocolate with a blend of smooth caramel, toffee, and sea salt. And that sound good. So I was sent these, as well as the next item, uh, by some family. So, um, let's pop into them. Now I believe one of them's already partly eaten. Yes, thank you, Mom. But... She didn't, she didn't like it, so she wrapped it back up. Amazing. And here we go. We have the uh, nicely wrapped caramel. I don't read alien. You only get two in this thing, so. Better be damn good. Right, let's, let's see here. Doesn't look anything special. Just take a nice up close look. Let's see, focus. Lovely. It's really just a piece of chocolate. But you know, what are you gonna expect? Let's see how it is. Hard to say. Mim. It's all right. It's not bad, but considering that it's supposed to be, you know, good. I have a chocolate with sea salt and this toffee caramel. I'm expecting um maybe a bit more of a flavor. I kind of taste the salt. It's kind of there, adding a nice savory edge. Caramel, yes, definitely. Chocolate almost goes away when you eat it, but it's not bad. But, you know, I'm not sure how much one of these are individually, but if I were buying one of these, I'd, I'd want a bigger pack for my money. You know, we got we got a halfway eaten one here. Disgusting. Let's just finish this off. Come on, mom. Yeah, yeah. It's a cut above normal chocolate. So hey, that's something. So can't complain there. Anyone who's had. The dive of chocolate in the past knows that there's a cut above, but yeah, I'm definitely bringing out the salt in that one. That's a, that is very good, right there. That second one was much better, actually, ironically. And now for the second item: Walkers Pure Butter Shortbread Scotty Dogs. They call Walkers because they're dogs. You walk the dog. Hey. It's a product of Scotland. This is an import here. Oh, I love this. Serving suggestion. Bow tie not included. The bow is not included. Ha! Huh. Whatever we're gonna do, the bow is not included in this. Alright. Do we only have one in here? Sounds like it. 
Well, pure butter. I saw that and I knew I had to uh, investigate. I don't know. We get two. Oh. Huh. Kill me. Please. And he doesn't look too happy to be in there. Smushed in there with his cousin. All right. Let's get him open. Let's walk the dogs. But from walkers, because they walk the dogs. That kill me. Come on. Hey, there we go. Ooh, my. Greasy texture. But I guess, you know, it's his bar short bread. So, you know, walking the dog. This is Walker's bread. Oh, the dog just got its head pulled off. That's a damn shame. All right, doggy. Let's see what you taste like. Eh. It's shortbread. It just tastes like shortbread. Yeah, I saw the pure butter shortbread. I was expecting some really sexy Paula Dean level stuff, you know? But. It's alright. But, um. Not really special, you know? Maybe a little bit more tasty than like the Lorna Dune shortbread cookies, but honestly, these are not much different from that. I don't even know how long this thing is good for. Best before date, I don't even know. 31% milk. Huh. I mean, it's crunchy a little bit. It's got a soft enough texture to it, but and what more can I say? It's a shortbread cookie, biscuit, basically. Yeah. Not altogether that impressed. Uh, but hey. It still wasn't bad. Well, we'll see how I feel about this one. Well, let's make that joke one more time, huh? Walkers, walking the dog, walking the... Walk your own fucking dog.